What is going on guys? Welcome back. Commentary for you. How does 2K football stay relevant? I mean, that's a question a lot of people ask. This is an old tweet though. Four Verts Podcast. One of the most under-discussed topics from yesterday, Clint Oldberg confirms off-ball injuries. Game changer for connected franchise mode. I hope he meant to say he is a game changer. This was not a game changer, man. You guys really get it twisted sometimes. Rex Dixon, not even currently with EA, but confirms it. It's not just about putting it in. It's doing it right. Do it right for the sim community. So, take a look here. All-pro football. Cornerback. Pulls up. Can't actually defend the pass. Pass is completed. Here is a quarterback trying to run out of the pocket, spasm, cramp, can't even get out of bounds, and gets gang tackled. Not even related to the play, though. Here is a safety that comes over to try to assist in a tackle, starts holding his knee, falls to the ground, and collapses. And these are things that happen all the time in football. Not just in football, but really athletes in general. Now let's take a look at Mad 19. Quarterback gets a big hit. I like it. Quarterback now is going to be injured according to the game. So Madden, play the injury animation. Bang. I mean, really. This is all pro football again. This is a lineman that gets hurt. So, kind of falls off the block shed, goes to get up, and then it's an animation. It looks realistic. As if he could not hold his own weight, goes back down to the ground, and lays down. This is a game from 2008. 2008. Now, let's go and take a look at the game from 2018. If you didn't know anything about football games, you would not look at this and say, this is an injury from a game 10 years newer than the one you just showed where the player just all of a sudden collapses because he's injured. It's not just about doing it. It's about doing it right. It's about the details. It's about paying attention to details. Don't just do it to do it. Don't just put it in the game to tell me that it's in the game. Because when you do that, you get people who, you know, inadvertently say, oh, this is in the game. It's going to be a big change, big difference. Love to see it. Glad we support the community. Glad we support the game. But then we get it, and this is the end result. This isn't what I want to see. This isn't the off-ball injury that I need. This had no relevance to the play. It's a player that got hit, and then five seconds later after standing there, falls to the ground. This is why 2K football stays relevant. This is why 2K football will continue to stay relevant until EA actually steps up it makes a conservative effort to build a better game where we can actually look at footage from now and say completely without bias it is better than where we were before across the board if you watch this video and you tell yourself that what you saw out of madden is better than what you saw out of all pro football then you're lying to yourself and that's okay a lot of people in this community lie to themselves. A lot of people in this community lie to the community. I'm not one of them. I want to thank 2K Football Now and make Madden better for those clips. I appreciate you guys watching this video. And you know that I'll be back in the week with more commentary.